day, I'm going to execute and tack here uh, from close haul to close haul. Uh, the, uh, I'm steering on the wind vane right now. So the first thing I'm going to do is uh, disengage the wind vane so it's not steering and I'm going to steer with the wheel. And uh, I'm going to come about, get established with the wheel pilot. Uh, and then re-engage the wind vane on the other tack. Otherwise, you can have the wheel and the wind vane kind of competing with each other. So that's what I'm going to do. And uh, oh, pilot can control the boat from here on. So you can see there the wheel pilot is steering there now. And now I'm disengaging the wind vane. I'm essentially locking it out so that it's not steering. And we'll leave the wind vane alone until we've completed the tack, we'll bring the jib around, we'll set up the sails on the new tack, we'll use the wheel to um, adjust for weather helm, and then lock the wheel, and the last thing we do is re-engage the wind vane. So I'm executing the tack here right now, coming through the eye of the wind, and I'm just going to leave the jib so I've come through the wind and I'm just going to leave the jib backed for now. So the jib is backed and I'm going to set up the wheel effectively now. I'm, I'm hove to, but I'm going to somewhat center the wheel, lock it, and then re-engage the wheel pilot. So now the wheel pilot is steering on the new tack and then I can bring the jib across. So now I'm bringing the jib across on the other side. Um, get it initially over there so that it's, it's not luffing. Then I go back. Here I am now back at the wheel and just fine tuning the course now. So now I'm, I'm over on the new tack. The, we're on the starboard tack. And I just want to fine tune the uh, uh, the course with the wheel pilot still for the for the new tack, and now I'm gonna kind of fine tune the sail. So now I'm cranking in the jib to fine tune it for the new tack, and I want to get that into the right spot. You want to. Still steering with the wheel pilot on this new compass bearing in this new wind direction. I'm continuously checking. Now I'm going to come over and I'm going to adjust the main. So you want to, or on the new tack, you want to adjust the sails as close as you can to the new tack. Get the boat as balanced as you can. And now I'm going to go back again and I've set the jib, I've set the main, and I'm going to go back and just fine tune the wheel. Again, still steering with the wheel. And I'm checking, you know, when you change the, the, uh, the sheeting of the sails, that affects the boat. So now I'm, I am now on the, the, uh, the course that I want. I've locked the wheel one more time, and now I'm going to go up and just give the final the final fine tuning so I'm checking the sails, I'm checking the main, I'm checking the wind direction we're slightly above uh, a beam reach, we're on a close reach and I'm looking at my telltales, I'm looking at the main and I want to get the boat as balanced as I can and uh, so I'm going to grab the uh, I want to crank that main in just a little bit. So I'm just luffing a bit, so I want to crank the main in just a bit. So I want to get the sails as balanced as I possibly can with the boat on this course. Right now, the wheel is still steering. And so the naturally, with the wheel steering, it is currently right now adjusting for any weather helm that I have. So what I'll do here is 
I'll lock off the wheel and then the last thing I'll do is is set up the wind vane uh, for the new tack. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to bring the wind vane around with the adjusting cord and get it approximately on a, on a close reach and um, um, also I'm bringing it around I will set up the wind vane in, the, in approximately the right the right spot I'll lock the wheel and then I will re-engage the wind vane so the wind vane can start steering and then I'll have a little bit of work to do just to fine tune the last little bit of steering on the wind vane and that has us finish the tack. Mm -hmm.